good time. I want to get something inside there, so I'll be back. So crazy. What? Just what? Where? I mean, how? What did he say to you? For what did you say to him? I went to the filling station to get some fuel, right? Mm -hmm. And I thought this guy was dead. I just saw him coming out of the mud. So what happened next? I mean, I freaked out and I went hiding. Oh but God, Clara! Clara! I run. How do you mean you run? Come on, girl, you've spent the past three years of your life wondering where this man has been. And then you get to see him finally and all you could do was run? Yes, I run. Florence, you don't get it, do you? Okay, I thought he was dead or something. I... Florence, I... I'm just confused. I... I don't even know what to say. Oh, Jesus okay. Christ. You don't get it. Where are your shoes? I didn't even notice. I I think I left it on the street somewhere. <laughs> oh God, Clara. I came in a taxi. I haven't even paid that guy. He's outside. How did you come in a taxi? Where is your car? I left my car, Florence. I... <sighs> God, Clara. I'm struggling to understand you. You mean you abandoned your car along with every other thing that identifies you at a gas station simply because you saw a man and ran? My goodness, Kavra. Let me just go to the top. Let me just go to the car. Clara, we really have a long talk. I'll be right back. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Good afternoon, sir. Yeah, yeah, afternoon. 
Um, <clears throat> I'm sorry, we're here to pick up my friend's car. She left it here a while ago. You mean she abandoned it? You mean uh, you are the lady that abandoned your car, the fuel pump and run off? Sir, it wasn't intentional. No, no, no. I'm sorry there is nothing we can do. We saw what you did as a security threat. So we've involved the police, please. Sir, please, please. Um, listen, it hasn't gotten to that. Please. It was just a simple misunderstanding. It was not that simple, madam. For your friend here to have left a car at a public service station and ran off, she poses a security threat to the community. No, sir, it shouldn't get to that. Please. It has gotten beyond that. There is nothing we can do. You are putting the life of the people here at risk. I don't want my car to end up at the police station. Is there something I can do? This has gotten to the station. A tow van is on its way to tow this vehicle to the police department. Sir, please, 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 please. We're begging you, please. I'm, I'm sure we can resolve this. Please. Please. Madam, madam, don't stress yourself. They've reported the case. When you get to our station, you have more time to explain yourself. Oh, yeah. Please, get the towing vehicle people online, please. Just calm down, everything will be fine. It's just wrong. I can't, yes. I can't just take it. Yes. It's wrong. This is wrong. Let me guess. You went back to that fuel station again. God, Clara. Clara! Why do you keep doing this to yourself? I mean, what do you intend to achieve by going back to this gas station every day? You've been there for like, what, five or six days now? Really? You don't know why. Clara, why does not matter? I don't want to see you get hurt again. I mean, it's been over three years that I taught you you should be over him by now. I am over him. I just need to know why. 
And what difference do you think that will make? Cara. I don't know. I, I just have a feeling that... That I'm, you're going to get hurt I'm again. not going to hurt myself, okay? Florence, listen. I need to do this, okay? I need some closure. You need some closure. Have you ever thought about this? What, what if you do not run into him again? What if that meeting at that gas station was just a one-chance encounter? Well, then I guess I won't be having my little closure. I'll learn to live with that. <sighs> you know I'm here for you, right? Florence, I know I I appreciate you, okay? I appreciate everything you've done for me. But this is for me. Okay, I need to find out once and for all. I need to do this for myself. I'm not going to throw away anything. It's okay. I understand you. Look, I'm not trying to sound like your mother or anything. But you know that I always have your back. I mean, you've progressed so much and I do not want to see you lose that. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> <laughs> And on a lighter note, I need you to go and clean up. Kwame is going to be here later. He wants us to hang out. And I want you to come with us. Um, can I stay in for tonight? No. No, you're not staying in, girl. You're coming with us. Who knows? You might even find your mister, right? I have a man in my Ah, which man? That's boy that is what? 25? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> I told you he's 28. I've told you that before. Ah. Stop. Are you trying to tell me that you bought him? Stop it! <laughs> I'm inside. <laughs> oh God, Clara.
It's just not possible. Wow. So, you came to Ghana to look for me? I did not come to Ghana to look for you. I came to Ghana to get over you. Stop. Let me, let Stop. me explain, okay? Stop! Quincy, you have no explanations. What are you going to say? Something happened, okay? I was arrested on the night of our wedding. That's what happened. Can we at least go somewhere and talk? Please. Let's, let's go somewhere and talk, no, okay? No, you ran off. You left. No phone call. No explanations. Nothing. What you take me for? Clara, you don't understand. Look. I got arrested on the night of our wedding. Let's go somewhere. Let me let's talk. Okay? Can you please indulge me? Chrissy, I fell in love with you. I believed everything you said. I was willing to get married to you. Baby, I was I was willing to get married to you too. Something happened. Can we talk? Let's just go somewhere and talk, okay? <sighs> okay. I'll try. Join me in my car. No, I mean, let's let's go on this one. I don't trust you. I'd cross a thousand rivers, I'd cross a thousand seas, I'd swim across the oceans, cause I'm coming back to you. There's a million things I want to say to you, but I cannot find the words. All I know, when I find you, I will never let you go. Can I get you something? No, thank you. I mean, let's at least get something. I'm fine. Thank you. Clara. I must say it's still looking stunning and beautiful. Something tells me Clara. it's just a fairy tale. Look, I, Just like chasing the wind. It's never my intention to hurt you, you know. You know, deep down your heart, I will never do anything to hurt you. Chrissy, do you know how it feels? Do you know how it feels to be in love and wake up one morning knowing that, to know that you're getting married to the man of your dreams? Do you know? Do you know the excitement, the the chills, the? Do you know how it feels to be a woman in love? Do you have any idea? Clara, I... and relax. He's not picking up his phone. Joe is not picking up too. I know. Look, look, you're crying. Hey, Cara, stop this. Okay, I I've said it countless times. Relax. Kwesi will be here in no time. 
and I'm sure he will give you an explanation to all of this. You know, maybe boys' night out. You see, that's I'm so something. scared. I'm scared. I know that you're scared. Clara, I know. Okay, I, and I cannot say that I know exactly how you feel. <sighs> Look, Chrissy will be here. And I'm sure he, he will explain all of this. You and Chrissy are made for each other. Hmm? See, you have said this a thousand times, but it's true, you'll be here. The number you called has not answered. Please call Matlika. Do you know that that man doesn't ever want to see you hurt? I've never really seen anyone love another the way Chrissy loves you. <sighs> Things will go on fine. And then, after today, you will become Mrs. Clara Quisi. <laughs> that is supposed to make you smile. Come on, smile. <laughs> it's my girl. Something tells me it's just a fairy tale, just like chasing the wind. But I choose to believe you anyway. Something tells me it's the good to be true. Clara, everything will be fine. Okay? What could have happened to him? he have an accident? How could he abandon me here like that? <sighs> Do you know, Clara, the truth is, I don't have the answers to all of these questions. I wish I did. But I'm as confused as you are. I don't know why I have this strong feeling that Quisi will be here and then when he comes, I'm sure there has to be, there has to be a reason for all of this. morning of our wedding, Joseph, myself and a couple of other guys were arrested. Arrested? Yes, please. We were arrested. We decided to go... We decided to go grab a few bottles that night. Myself, Joseph, and we met these guys, we didn't know them, but they were like, oh, they want to come along because we're staying in the same hotel. After taking a couple of shots, I, I don't 
don't know what happened, but I all I could remember was they asking me if um, what I was yeah they asking me what I was doing in Nigeria and um, me telling them even though I knew our marriage was a secret one, me telling them I was getting married the next morning. That's all I could remember. Kwesi, I know all of this is in the past, but I, I just want to understand why you left me. You left me. You just you stood me up on our wedding day. Something tells me it's just a fairy tale, just like chasing the wind. The truth of the matter is, we were arrested. So you think I'm so stupid to sit here and believe everything you're saying? You want me to believe all the lies you're telling me? You want me to believe everything you're saying? Clara, I'm not lying. I slept through the night, not being conscious of happening to run me. I was awakened by the knock and the bangs on the door. Who is it? Who is it? Yes. Who is that? Are you Kusi Adai? Yes, how may I help you? I'm Inspector Michael Jesse from the Nigerian Police, and that's my colleague Sergeant Vincent. You are under arrest for drug trafficking. You are advised to keep silent because anything you do or say will be used against you in the court of law. Please move it. Drugs? Really? No, that was the accusation. You've known me, Clara. I never deal in drugs. It was just unfortunate we ran into these guys, we didn't know who they were. We were just trying to be nice. We went out together, had a couple of drinks, and the next thing, we saw ourselves in prison. We in prison, hoping to get out the next morning, it didn't happen. Hoping to get out the next week, we were still there. For months, we were there. When it was about eight months in jail in a foreign country. You were arrested, right? So why didn't you call anyone? Why didn't you call me? Why didn't you call someone for help? My phone was taken from me on the night that we were arrested. Besides, we were not given any opportunity to make any call. The I crime was so grave that drugs were not allowed to call anyone. I don't believe you. Baby, I'm not lying. It was after eight months that we were ringed before court and they found us you know, not guilty. We were acquitted and, you know, sent back to Ghana. When I got back to Ghana, I didn't know where to begin from. I didn't know where to find you. I didn't know what to do. I tried every means possible to get in touch with you. But to no avail. I'm not lying. Something tells me it's just a fairy tale. Just like oh. chasing the wind. <sighs> Phone call. Yeah, we're supposed to meet up some friends and hang out, but I'll call her later. Well, Florence? Yep. Is she back in Ghana? Yeah. She got a transfer, you know, here, so she had to come and then she convinced and insisted that I joined her. Oh, maybe um, I could also explain myself to Florence. If, if you permit me, I could come by the house and you know, talk to Florence as well, let her understand, you know, what truly happened. No. <laughs> Chrissy, I don't think that will be necessary. Listen. I'm not saying I believe everything you've said right now, okay? I'm not saying I believe you. <sighs> I'll need time to process all of it. Okay, just give me some time. Can I... Ask you a question. Yeah, shoot. Sure. So how did you find me? So there was this day, one afternoon, I went to the filling station to get some fuel and I decided to quickly go into the mart to grab some biscuits and you know, get back and shockingly, that's why I saw you. You see. I was so shocked. I couldn't believe it. I thought I had seen a ghost. 
so I didn't even, you know, it, it was like split seconds. I just rushed out. I left my shoes outside. I left my car. You know, the aftermath was crazy. The police came into the picture. They towed my car. It was just a lot of things happened. So, sorry. so I was always going back there. I would go, you know, send my car, look around, see if I would see you. I needed some closure, Chrissy. I kept going back. I was always going back there, you know, I, I, I just wanted to see you again. I thought I was going to meet you there again. I wanted to know why you... I'm, I'm so sorry, oh. I'm so sorry. Um, I want to see you again. Can I at least have your number? Something tells me it's just a fairy tale, just like chasing the wind. But I choose to believe you anyway. Something Please. tells me it's the good to be true. Please, can you give just me a number? Mirage, but I choose to believe. I'll think about it. Hey Flo! Don't tell me you went back to that gas station again. Flo, I'm so sorry. I, I know I was supposed to call. Okay, but so much happened I forgot. I'm sorry. Hmm? That's alright. Just forget about it. I saw Kwesi. Don't play with me, girl. I'm serious. So what did that idiot say to you? Wait, I, are you all right? Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I'm fine. Mm -hmm. I'm fine. So? So what? How do you mean, so what? What did you guys say? What did you say to him? I, I want to hear everything. Yeah, we talked, okay? We talked a lot. So, tell me, I need the details. Flo, it's all scattered in my head. I don't know what to believe. I don't. But right now I'm starving, so let me go get something for us to eat and then we can talk and gist and do all of that. I just to get to it because I'm starving as well. Okay. For the gist, I mean. Yeah, but let me change, let me change. I'm hungry, oh my goodness. Across a thousand rivers, I'd cross a thousand seas, I'd swim across the oceans, cause I'm coming back to you. There's a million things I wanna say to you, and I cannot find the words. All I know, when I find you, I will never let you go. Don't know how I let you go for so long It's not my fault that you can put the blames on me Let me tell you how I miss you so bad Everywhere I go, you always on my mind I'm moving on, but I don't seem to know how Cause every day I wish I met you somehow Every time I pray Lord, please keep her for me Guide and protect her for me Do this one thing for me I'm begging you so, are you telling me that you believe everything he said, who Klein and Sinka? Florence, honestly, I, I don't know what to believe. But you know what? There were times when I believed the stuff he said. All right, I don't know why I have this very strong feeling that Chrissy has all of this planned out. Yes, I, I sense something fishy. 
<laughs> I think Quincy was married here. And that's why he left you. Flo. So, <laughs> if he has a wife, why did he leave her in Ghana and stay in Nigeria for that long? Uh, same reason he left you in Nigeria. Same reason. <sighs> What's he gonna get from needing me? Oh, my dear, listen, that's people for you. I mean, people just do things. They don't have to have any reason before they do it. This guy basically took care of all my needs. You know what, I'm not even sure that matters anymore. I'm just not comfortable seeing him around you again. That's, by the way, what about yourself? How is he? Oh, Joe. Well, Joe was here for a bit, you know. He was around and then luckily for him, he got a job in Sierra Leone. So, he left. <laughs> but he comes around once in a while. Okay, and are you guys seeing each other again? Mm -hmm. We planned to hang out tomorrow. Where? Okay, see, <laughs> just ask him to come over here. I mean, I really want to see him. I want to look him in the eye and ask him why. Okay? You look beautiful. Thank you. Don't look at me like that. I just remember in the fun times, you and I, good memories. <laughs> okay, Quincy, I'm starving right now. Like, I can eat a grown man. Can we eat something? Can we order something? Oh, sure. I mean, if they have that on the menu, I, I will gladly order that for you. Oh, and I'll gladly eat it. <laughs> well, <laughs> I can eat a cow alive. Oh, really? <laughs> well, I used to know a girl who, like, her fiesta. With um, naturally squeeze orange juice and um, what else? What you? Is that what you want? <laughs> you still remember that? Of course, I remember. Wow. Should we go for that? Um, no, I'll just do jollof and chicken. Should we order your favorite? Yeah. You must be really hungry. I'm starving. I'm starving. I can't wait. Right. Um, excuse me. Across a thousand rivers, I'd cross a thousand seas, I'd swim across the oceans, cause I'm coming back to you. There's a million things I want to say to you, but I cannot find the words. All I know, when I find you, I will never let you go. I still love you. Percy, stop it. Stop it. Look, um... Stop. I don't want you to say yes, okay? It just... I just want you to know that I will do everything to try again with you. I, I don't need you to say anything, okay? Just... I just... I just want you to know. Chrissy, look, I... It's okay, it's okay. Something tells me it's just a fairy tale Just like chasing the wind You want some talent? Are you kidding me? You're eating on the sofa. 
Listen, I went through a lot to clean this place up. Please don't mess it up. Clara, I'm not messing up anything, okay? Besides, I don't want your boyfriend to come here and think we're dirty people. Stop that. Stop what? Is it not your boyfriend? Just don't mess up the place, okay? Please. Okay. I've heard hmm? you, girl. I'm just teasing. I'm not even listening to you. <laughs> Clara, please, there. Eh? Anything you're preparing, mm. make it for four, yeah. okay? Yes, because I might just decide to invite Tony over. Okay. Mm. Yes. Are you serious? Please. No. Girl, please. <laughs> <laughs> please now. <laughs> Well, um, I'm trying to impress you. Hope it's working. <laughs> Anyways, I brought wine. Thank you. You're very kind. You're welcome. Thank you. Have a seat. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Okay, I'll be in the kitchen. Oh. Hi, Phil. Hi. You're well. Yeah. You really look good for someone who has been in prison. Nice. Um, thank you. You look good, sir. Look, um, Flo. I'm sorry, okay? I'm really sorry, okay? I I wish I could explain everything that happened, but um, you just wouldn't understand. I'm so sorry. It was never my intention to hurt Clara. A lot has happened, okay? Just, I'm just trying to make things right. I understand, Chrissy. And Clara told me everything. But trust me, you did not try. That's why I'm trying to make things right, please. Just understand. What are you guys talking about? <clears throat> Nothing, girl. You know, catching up on old times. Okay, well, the food is ready. Can we eat while she guys, you know, continue the conversation? Yes, madam. <laughs> Let's go. Something tells me it's just a fairy tale, just like chasing the wind. Come on, Chrissy. Come on. Okay. Let's say I believe that your friends were taken away from you. What happened to Facebook? Why didn't you look any of us up? I thought about it. But I just couldn't do it. You couldn't do it? For a woman you claim you love so much,
I never really thought I was going to set my eyes on you again. And if I did, <laughs> I had made up my mind I was going to make you go through the worst imagined horror. But here we are. Okay, guys, um, do you want me to clear the table? Are you guys done? Just show me the direction and I'll, I'll take the dishes, okay? No, no. no. For all time's sake, let me do it, okay? No. I'll do it. Oh, I'll it. okay, okay, okay. I'm done. And I think I've had enough to drink. I'll be going up to my room and rest it all out. I'll leave you guys to it. Hasn't changed. Nope. Not a bit. <laughs> okay, on the issue of the dishes, let me do them. Okay, wait, I take them to the kitchen. Come up for the other one. Just like chasing the wind But I choose to believe you anyway Something tells me it's too good to be true Just a mirage But I choose to believe You're never telling me the truth so. at all So what? I want to see you every moment. Every day. Kwesi, this is my house. You know where to find me. No, that's not what I mean. I... I want you to... know where I live. You know, come see my friends. I want us to start all over again. I can't stay a moment without you. See, this is too fast, okay? It's just too fast for me. Look, I... I love you so much, Clara. I know, and I love you too, but it's just that... It's just that I... I want us... I want us to get married. I want to marry you, like, now. Tomorrow, just, just let me know. I can't stay a moment without you. Crazy. Crazy. I'd cross a thousand rivers. I'd cross a thousand seas. I'd swim across the oceans. Cause I'm coming back to you. There's a million things I want to say to you But I cannot find the words All I know, when I find you I will never let you go Don't know how I let you go for so long I am not telling you that. Yeah, okay. I don't know what you're talking about. I don't know. Okay, what Elma? <laughs> Come back already. I miss you. It's been nine days already. <laughs> so crazy. Florence, you went to work and not to look for me. You already have a boyfriend. Or oh, you want me to tell him? Okay, alright. No, I'm, I'm not. Lip sealed. I'm, no, I'm not going to say anything. I won't say anything. Boris, <laughs> you worry too much. You worry too much. 
I'm fine. I already told you. Okay, all right. Um, you know what? Kwesi is calling me. Let me. Um, I'll call you back. Hey baby. Oh, I miss you too. I can't wait to be in your arms. <laughs> so how's the meeting going? Good? Ah, oh, my gosh, I'm too bad. It's crazy, we both have to work. Um, I know. Baby, so I'll, I'll leave you. I'll leave you now. Okay, get back to work. Okay. Let me know when you're free. Love you too. Across a thousand rivers, I'd cross a thousand seas, I'd swim across the oceans, cause I'm coming back to you. There's a million things I want to say to you, but I cannot find the words. All I know, when I find you, I will never let you go. No stay break. You look so beautiful, like a work of art. I couldn't get my eyes off you. Thank you. What's the time? Does it really matter? It's the weekend. You're not working, I'm not working. So let's just stay in bed and enjoy. <laughs> mm -hmm. Meanwhile, I like, get your breakfast. Uh, oh, wow. I cook for really? you, baby. Oh, that's so sweet. All right, like. A man who cooks. <laughs> Can you add avocado? I, <clears throat> I came back late last night, so and my phone was dead, so I couldn't call you. Yes. Okay. Okay. All right. I'll, I'll wait. I'll wait. All right, then. So I, I'll get in touch pretty shortly. Okay. Mr. Tony, listen, there is no way I can come in today. It's not possible. All of this is new. You're just springing this up on me. <sighs> ah, Mr. Tony, see, I have other plans for today and there is no way I can see you today. Let's just do this. I will send the documents over to you and then later in the day, I would call you to find out how you're doing with them. That should be fine. Okay, okay. All right then. Later. <sighs> hey, Jesus. you. 
Hey girl, I don't know what is wrong with this man. He would never let me be. He just doesn't give up. <laughs> he doesn't. He likes you. Maybe you should get that into your head. Okay. He likes you too. Maybe you should try. Um, <laughs> nah, I'll pass. So, mm -hmm. guess what? What? What, girl? What is this? <laughs> okay, so Quissy asked me to marry him. Oh. Mm -hmm. And? And I said yes. You did? Listen, he, oh gosh, it was so romantic. He went down on one knee. He asked me to marry him. And of course, I said yes. Look at my ring. Look, 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 look. Can I see the ring? Hmm. Yeah. Okay, but don't touch it. Don't touch it, okay? It's, it's yes. quite new. Very new. I hear you, madam. It's beautiful. I know, it's beautiful. Ugh. Oh. Huh. Nice. Kill. Girl, you know, I mean, I, I don't want to see you hurt again. <sighs> Nothing is gonna happen, okay? He's serious this time around. Okay? Are you sure? Yeah. I'm okay. so excited. <laughs> Alright, I'll be inside. Okay, then. Be happy for me. Okay. I'll be inside. I'm happy for you. Thank you. Girl. Okay, so I'll see you later. Joe? Joseph? Yes. <laughs> what are you having? Look at you! Look at you! <laughs> oh Where have you God. been? Well, I've been here, but I cannot say the same for you. The last time I spoke with you, he said you went to Sierra Leone or yeah. was it Liberia? Sierra Leone, actually. Oh. We, I just came in last night mm. and we had actually planned on coming to see you ladies. <laughs> and look at you standing in front of me. Yes, look at me standing in front wow. of you. But see, it doesn't change anything. You guys can still come over. Well, that's true. That's mm -hmm. true. We'll, we'll do so. But um, I know Kwesi has told you everything that happened with Ascent, why we had to leave Nigeria and all that. She was saying, I know I owe you guys an apology. Joseph! Ah! What are you doing all the way there? Uh, just a minute, I'll be there. I need a trolley. That's actually my sister, Abna. Uh, oh. Can I just attend to her quickly and then come back? Oh, yes, you can. We, if we don't happen to see each other again, maybe tonight we can link up. Cool? Sure, cool. <laughs> Please. Good to see you it's once again. Good to again. see you too. Very good. I'll good be back. I'll be All back. right, then. All right, uh, bye. Abna. <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, you got some of the towels? Is that all? Are you done? Yeah, I'm okay. Mm. I think I'm okay. So we're set, Abby. Yeah, turn off. All right, cool. I don't want a situation where you tell me you left something behind. Uh, Hi. Sorry. Hi. So what time is your flight? Actually, I can't stay here past 11 a.m. So whatever we are doing has to be done today. Because okay. I got to catch my flight. I'm sure we can work something out. So, oh, shh. Oh. What is it? 
I actually I have to get some brush, some hair brush. I forgot that. Ladies. <laughs> Hey. Chrissy's mine. What? Yes. Chrissy is married. I don't understand. I ran into Joseph at the mall today. And another lady who apparently is his sister. <sighs> Wait. And they told you Chrissy is married. How is that even possible? Oh my goodness. I'm, I'm so sorry, okay? I, I wasn't looking. So sorry. Sorry. It's okay, it's okay. Uh, are you not the lady I saw with Joe so many ago? Uh, Joe, Joe, Joe. Oh, you mean Joseph? Yes, yes. Um, his friend. Yes, and you are? Um, his sister. I'm Joe's sister. I was going to say that, you know. <laughs> Please don't. You. How long have you known my brother, Joe? Because I practically know all his friends, both male and female. <laughs> um, Joe and I are not that close. I'm actually a friend of Chrissy. So you must be a friend to his wife. I mean, Chrissy's wife's friend. I'm sorry, what? Whose wife? Chrissy. Chrissy's wife. Oh, oh, no, <laughs> no. I'm. Chrissy's friend, not his wife's friend. Oh, okay, I'm sorry. Um, um, my name is Sabina, and nice to meet your acquaintance. And I'm Florence, nice to meet you, Abna. Okay, so I hope we can meet again. Oh, yes, I'm um, sure, sure. All right, all right then. So if Chrissy is truly married, why is he putting me through all of this? Why is he doing this? Honestly, I, I don't know what to say right now. Um, Clara, maybe you should call him. You know, just call him and find out what his reason is. Go ahead. Hello? Yeah, um, can you come over? I don't think I can leave the house. Yeah, just come over, please. Yeah, yeah, I'm fine. Okay. Thank you. Do you... So... I've changed my mind. House. And you think that's a good thing to do? Yes. Okay, then I'm coming with you. No, no. I'll, I want to do this alone. Girl, I'm not letting you go alone. Flo. Florence, I'll be fine. I promise, I'll be fine. <sighs> okay, then. Flo. If that lying son of a bitch comes here, tell him I've gone to his house. I'll see you soon. Okay. All right. Call me, okay? Oh, God. Oh. 
Oh. Yo. That was Chief. Oh, he didn't sound so happy about the construction project. <laughs> you never take advice, do you? I told you we shouldn't use those guys, but you wouldn't listen. Don't huh? worry, um, it's okay. I'm, I'm meeting them tomorrow. We'll work something out. Well, I'm not available tomorrow. No problem, I'll handle it. Um, meanwhile, um, Clara called me like 20 minutes ago and um, she requested to see me ASAP. Wait, you think she knows something? Um, I don't know, but I, I doubt it. Did, did Florence speak with Abna? I don't know. They barely know each other. What could they be discussing? Um, it's, it's just that she sounded so cold. And that's unlike her, you know? Kwesi, I think it's about time you let this girl know her stance. You're a married man. Why are you entertaining her and giving her false hope and making her believe she has a part in your life? You know I can't, you know. I love her so much. Look at this guy. What are you talking about? I thought this thing ended way back in Nigeria. We're in Ghana now and you're still talking like this. Just let her know. I'm sure she'll understand. Okay. Maybe I'll, I'll just tell her the truth. But, you know, it's, it's not going to be easy. You're a man. Find a nice way of talking to her. I'm sure she'll understand. It shouldn't be too hard. Yeah. Hopefully she will understand. Yeah. <laughs> Clara, good to see you. Hey, hey, hey. I'm not in the mood for all of that. Kwesi, are you married? Uh, okay, guys, I think I need to... No, go. no. Sit down. You're a part of this. Are you going to answer me or not? Yes, I'm, I'm sorry, baby. I can explain, okay? You can explain. I can explain. You can explain. Uh, you guys, I, I, I need to go. I'll see you later. Hmm? Sure, no, thank you. Baby. You can explain. Yes. Hey, 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 hey. Don't touch me. Don't. Baby, let me talk, okay? What do you have to explain? Look, I'm, Must you explain everything? I'm sorry I didn't tell you earlier. I just, I just didn't know how to tell you. Oh, because you wanted more of me, right? That is not it. Just, just listen okay, to me. Okay, okay. <sighs> okay. I don't want to hear any more of your lies. You see, why wouldn't you just let me be? Baby. Why'd you have to do this to me a second time? Baby, listen to me. I never left you. The truth is I was arrested. I never stopped loving you. Why? I got married, yes, I got married. I didn't get married because I loved her. I got married. Because I was empty and alone without you, don't you understand? Baby, please, just listen. Let me tell you everything. Just just like chasing the wind. But I choose to believe you anyway. Something tells me it's too good to be true. Just a miracle. But I choose to believe When I came back to Ghana, I was lost. I was confused, disoriented. The first four months were tough. I didn't know what to do. The thought of you not being with me and probably being with another man made it worse. I almost contemplated suicide. 
Then I, I met Akosia. Akosia was a nice person. She, she helped me. I, I just felt I owed her. So, after six months of friendship, we got married. Yeah, but I didn't marry her because I loved her. I married her because I felt I owed her and I felt there was nothing more to live for. Good for you. I hope you guys are happy together. That's the thing, Clara. It's, it's not working. We, we are not even like that anymore. I filed for a divorce and she would not let me have it. We started fighting, quarreling, arguing here and there. It was very unpleasant. I left the house. Two months later, she went to her parents in Liberia and ever since, we've not been communicating. That's just what it is. Please, say something. What do you want me to say? Say anything, anything, just say something. Just... <sighs> How long? Um, it's been five months now. She said nothing to me and I have said nothing to her. No, I meant how long have you been married? Four months. And you didn't think I deserved to know any of this? You didn't think I deserved to know the truth? That's the mistake. I, I was afraid. I, I didn't know how you were going to take it. <sighs> I'm sorry. Hey. Oh, stop it, stop it, stop I love you so much. Oh. Okay. I don't want to be a home wrecker. Baby. It was already a wreck before you came on the scene. I Something love you so much. Please, let me work it. Let me work at dissolving the marriage and you and I can finally get married. Something tells me it's just a fairy tale. Just like chasing the wind. But I choose to believe. What am I supposed to do? What he said was the truth. I still think you should have demanded to know more. Yes. More about what? Huh. We talked about pretty much everything. So Clara, you believe Chrissy would dissolve his marriage just like that to get married to you? I'm supposed to believe him, right? Oh God, Clara. Clara, when did you become so gullible? What is even so special about this Chrissy that you cannot dump his miserable ass? What? Eh? Where is it even written that a lady has to be married before she can be fulfilled? It's not about being fulfilled or anything. Florence, I love Chrissy. I've always loved him. I did like him a lot too, before he broke your heart. He did not break my heart. Oh. Florence, stop it. Stop. Clara, why can't you just open your eyes? Open your eyes now and see what is happening. My eyes are wide opened. I want you to stop worrying, okay? Just support me. Be happy for me. Girl, you know I'm happy for you. You know, I just do not want to see your heart again. Come. Listen. Smile. I'm smiling. Everything will be fine, okay? I promise you. Hmm? Sure. Ah, you worry too much. Oh. If I don't worry about you, who will? But I choose to believe you anyway. Something tells me it's the good to be true. Just a mirage. But I choose to believe you're never telling me. Truth at all, but I deserve to know it after all. Play with my heart like that, it's not fair at all. Who do you think you are after all? Something tells me just a 
another lie. Yes, I know it's a lie. I know it's a lie. But I choose to believe you anyway. Someone tell me is loving you a cry. Oh God. Hello. Hey, um, Chrissy, listen, I don't know, my car just stopped, okay? I, I've, I've been trying to call my mechanic, he's not picking up. Yes, I am on the, you know, the Coco Vanilla Road? Yes, on the same street. Please, please, I don't know if you can help me, please. I don't know what the problem is, okay? I, it just stopped. And I have a very important meeting. And I have a very important meeting. I can pick a taxi if, if, if you can't make it. I... Okay, okay. All right. Thank you. I'd cross a thousand rivers, I'd cross a thousand seas. I'd swim across the oceans, cause I'm coming back to you. There's a million things I want to say to you But I cannot find the words All I know, when I find you I will never let you go Oh, baby! <sighs> what happened? I don't even know, I... I was driving and then, you know, it started shaking, oh, jerking, yeah. yeah. Oh, okay, no and problem. then um, it, it stopped. I tried calling my mechanic, but he wasn't picking up. No problem. I'm here, yeah. baby. You know, I'll do anything Thank for you. you. Um, yeah. I need to get to the office ASAP. So if you don't mind, you can join me in that. So I'll drop you where you're going. I'll okay. You where yeah. You're going. Okay, cool. Yeah. Please, can you give me my purse? Please. Thank you. Okay. So you can go now. Okay. Um, Tell Kwame to call me when you fix it, okay? okay Anything, just call me, okay? okay I'm here for the interview. For the interview? Yes, please. Okay. Just wait there. Thank you. All right. Hello. Clara Williams? Yeah. That's You're here for the makeover chat? Yes, please. Okay. Go upstairs, second door on your left. That's where you're headed. Okay, all right. Thank you very much. You're welcome. <sighs> Sorry to bother you. I noticed the green G Wagon dropped you off. Yes. Was that Kwesi Adei? Yeah, that was him. Okay, I thought as much, but I wasn't so sure. Okay, I would like to see you when you're done. Okay, all right, thank you. Okay. Let me get it.
My sister gave me this for his wife. I misplaced her number. Are you saying you know Kwesi? Yes. My sister was his wife's best friend and the maid of honor on their wedding day. They've been married for like seven years now. <sighs> Are you okay? Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm fine. I just, I just, I just got a migraine. I have a migraine. I... Oh, then let me get you some water to drink. Please. Okay, excuse me. Something tells me it's just a fairy tale. Just like chasing the wind. But I choose to believe you anyway. Something tells me it's too good to be true. Just a mirage But I choose to believe You're never telling me The truth at all Something tells me just another lie. Yes, I know it's a lie. I know it's a lie. But I choose to believe you anyway. Hello? Are you done? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I actually didn't think it was going to be this fast. Um, I'm already home. It went really fast. Yes. Yeah. Guess what? I was selected. Oh, that's good news. <laughs> I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. Thank you so much for everything. It's okay, I'm so happy for you. You know, I'm doing anything for you. So let's celebrate tonight, okay? Let me take you somewhere. Um, actually, I was thinking, um, why don't I come over tonight, okay? I can stay over, we can spend the entire weekend together. That okay. sounds tempting. Okay, wait, 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 wait. I have, I have something in mind. Um, I'm gonna get some wine, um, and then we can run the tab. And I'm gonna cook with nothing on. <laughs> I know you like that. Okay, baby, let's do it. Ah, you're so naughty. <laughs> You're so naughty. <laughs> okay, um, so I'll be on my way to yours and uh, I'll get everything ready. Okay. Why don't you get the wine when you're coming? I think that'll be faster. Yeah, right? I'll get the wine on my way home. Okay. Alright, see you. Love you, baby. Love you. No, I love you. <laughs> Alright, bye. Something tells me it's just a fairy tale, just like chasing the wind. But I choose to believe you anyway. Something tells me it's too good to be true, just a mirage. But I choose to believe you're never telling me. The truth, the truth at all, but I deserve to know it after all. After all. Play with my heart like that, it's not fair at all. Ooh. Who do you think you are after all? Something tells me just another lie. Yes, I know it's a lie, I know it's a lie, but I 
Sexy, man. Thank you. Hmm. <laughs> we have no party. Well, we deserve it, don't we? Yeah, we do. Good. Uh, okay, so I decided to try something new with you. Remember, I told you it's going to be soul food, physical food, and, mm. and then more soul food. Oh, you're so naughty, baby. <laughs> <laughs> okay, wait. <laughs> Why don't you go inside and, you know, take a shower, freshen up, change into something comfortable, and then, you know, we'll get to it. Um, so, what do you have in mind? It won't be a surprise if I tell you. Oh, uh, baby. No. I, I, I want to try new things with you, you know. That's so naughty. Let's explore. Okay, <laughs> mommy. All right. So, you should go have a shower? Yes, please do. Okay. Alright. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, baby. I'll see you. Okay. Oh, goodness, God. Oh, God. Cara, pick up. Pick up, come on. Oh, God. Go, pick, pick. Cara, pick. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my God. Tell you 
Oh my God. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my God. What do I even do? What do I do now? Oh my God, Clara Pink.
You know I smoke. Oh. <laughs> uh, uh, you want to say something? You want to say something? You want to keep lying? <laughs> Crazy. I loved you so much. I've always loved you. You came along, lied to me, left me in Nigeria to be with your family. Like that wasn't enough. Like that wasn't enough. You came back a second time and lied to me again. Do I look like a fool to you? And I believed you. Like it wasn't enough. Oh my goodness. Oh, because of love. Oh, because of love. Why do you keep lying? Mm -hmm. Mm -mm -mm. You want to explain? You want to mm -hmm. talk? Mm -hmm. Keep talking. How do you like this? How do you like it? It looks nice. I know. <laughs> Oh, is it painful? Is it painful? Let me give you some. Oh. <laughs> mm. Is it painful? Do you like it? Huh? <laughs> okay, so, um. I want to do something special to you tonight. Do you have any shout outs? You want to say good night? Well, good morning. I haven't checked the time. Hmm? Hmm? Any last words? You want to lie again? Tell me another story? <laughs> Open your mouth. Talk. Mm, lie. Hmm? Chasing the wind But I choose to believe you anyway Something tells me It's too good to be true Just tell me right Hello But I choose to believe Hi, um My name is Clara Williams Yes, I am calling from East Legon, Lagos Avenue, house number 26. I just shot a liar. Two. 